Okay, well, out of the uh, woods in Lehigh, Pennsylvania, and uh, I thought I'd take a second to uh, answer a lot of questions that have come up on how the uh, homemade range extender that I built for uh, the Cybertruck works. So uh, sometimes you're not as close to power, although you might be close to power lines as you hoped. So this is a quick walkthrough on the functionality of uh, the range extender. Uh, we'll talk through what's going on here. Uh, the heart of the system is a uh, 12,000 um, watt, 220 volt EG4, 12,000 XP inverter. This is actually the most expensive component of the system. Uh, mated to that is a Tesla wall charger. And um, we'll get on to a little backup uh, charges in a second. Uh, the wall charger requires constant 50 amps, uh, which this beast does provide. Um, the Victron is purely a uh, bus to make sure that I equally distribute the draw from each of these batteries, which is kind of positioned there. And uh, it's so simple to use. Uh, flip from on to off and grab your Tesla wall charger and just like you do at home plug in inverters kicking on getting a green light and let's go and see what type of charging we're getting okay Let's turn the music down before we land up getting a copyright hit of some description. All right, this is the impressive part, is we're getting 48 amps. Um, this is gonna take on a Cybertruck from 57%, four hours and 40 minutes. Now, realistically, I won't get four hours of charging. I'm gonna get about 20%, uh, should give me about 100 miles, 80 miles of range. Uh, but what we'll actually do is run this all the way flat to see what it can do. Uh, dead simple, really. Nothing too complicated about it. All right. Let's go see what's happening in the back. Uh, you're going to hear the inverter fans spinning up. Uh, the way that I position those fans is that I can close this all up if it's raining. I can even close up the bed, just making sure that I leave a fraction of space to uh, make sure it gets the ventilation that I need. Close up the bed and uh, you're good to go. All right, we'll be going through Q&A next. Uh, lots of questions on Twitter and or X, and I'll be addressing those next.